Alright, welcome back to another Pokemon Showdown video. I am once again Brawlfan1, and Danny is once again Roshetsu. Oh my god, <laughs> you have the beast! Yes, so this is another team, another fun little team I tried I tried uh, building up. This is a, 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 a team based off of the ability Simple. So Simple is an interesting, uh, is an interesting um, attack, or ability where any Pokemon that has it will gain double the amount of what of stat gain that they would have gained that they normally would have gained from their attacks. So let's see, we have hmm, a lot of threats to Lily Gant, unfortunately. However, my Lotic looks looks like it should be fine here. I'm seeing a lot of water weaknesses on your end. So let's go, let's head over to let, let's start with my Lotic, and we'll also start with Lanoon. Alright, so he went with a Revile. Oh, I know exactly what kind of team this is. I know exactly what you're playing, good sir. What? I, I see through your shtick. What's he this, doing? He's using a beat-up team. He's about to use the attack called beat-up on his own Terrakion with Weavile. Beat-up is a dark type attack that will do, um, that, that'll, that'll hit multiple times, so long as, like, depending on the, the, how healthy the rest of your team is. Since he's starting, since he's starting off with it completely, He's about to hit his Terrakion six times with a really weak attack. And Terrakion has the ability Justified. What Justified will do is, Justified will um will increase Terrakion's attack by one every single time he's hit by Beta. So I got a problem. So what I'm about to do, so let's 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 start let's start off how I normally would. I'm gonna use simple beam on my Milotic. Yep. See, there we go. So, who is he aiming for first? Is he aiming for Melodic, or is he aiming for Lanu? Yeah, as you see there, now this Trachea's at max attack. I have a problem. A really big problem! Good lord. Yeah, fuck this. <laughs> I'm not dealing with that. Fuck right. this shit, I'm out! Yeah, okay, here we go. Here's a different team. <laughs> Alrighty, so... Yep. Let's see... Wow, Lilligant is getting shat on. Everyone here fucks up Lilligant. What's that red thing? This guy? Yeah. Oh, uh, like, oh, Rotom, you mean? The, the washing machine? I've never seen that. Yeah, that, that's, one of Rotom's, that's one of Rotom's forms. So, Lanoon, and let's see, I think our best start right now would actually be Tyranitar. So we're starting with Rotom and Togekiss. So, that, so Tyranitar was actually my worst start. Good to hmm. know. Alright, so what I'm going to go ahead and do here is... Hmm. They're no doubt both probably going to aim at Tyranitar, so I'm going to switch... So you probably have Air Slash on here, so I'm actually gonna go ahead and... No, you're an Electric type though. FUCK! Alright. Lilligant, just go ahead and come on out. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. You use Simple Beam towards Tyranitar, and then Lilligant, you come out. Okay. So now Lilli Lilligant has the ability Simple. He burned Lilligant. Okay. And then used he Heat Wave. Oh, this fucker predicted me. Alright, alright. I see your game, good sir. Okay. I'm going to Thunder Wave the Togekiss. And then... Hmm. I'm not living under the heat wave. That's for certain. Um... So why not the Milotic? Because that's, that's an electric type like there. Mm. Alright, I'm gonna go for the synthesis. I'm hoping that once the Thunder Wave hits the Togetic, the Togekiss, it paralyzes. If it does, I have a better chance. Okay. Hydro Pump, it missed. Now please get paralyzed. Yes! Awesome! Awesome, awesome, awesome! My really obscure plan worked. Okay. So now I'm gonna use Super Fang on 
the toge kiss. Because that's my biggest threat right now. And then I'm gonna quiver dance. A simple a, a simple Lily Gang with Quiver Dance is effectively doubling its stats every turn. Hot damn. Okay, he got rid of Blanoon. He's probably gonna go for another heat wave as long as he's not paralyzed. There he goes. But look at that. We live in. That's, kind of. That's, a, that's why Lily Gant is the beast. Alright, so now. Now, 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 now. What I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna bring out Zatu. Zatu, you use Psych Up on Lilligant. Lilligant, you use Synthesis again. You need to heal. As long as that Togekiss doesn't pull an extreme speed out of nowhere, I should be fine. Oh, you switched. Okay. Okay. It's fine. So Synthesis, heal up. Psych Up! Now Zatu has all of Lilligant's stats. He discharged. Shit. I forgot about that. I forgot that it was an electric type. That's fine though, because Rotom Wash is a grass type. So, Zatsu, you roost, Lilligant, Giga Drain the, the Rotom. Nice! All oh, that juicy all oh, that juicy souls. <laughs> all of the juicy souls. Okay, here we go. Now things are going a lot more smoothly. He brought up Charizard. It's probably it's more than likely a Mega Charizard. Okay. So, if that is a Mega Charizard, which like, the question is, which Mega Charizard is it? If it's why, I got a bit of a problem. So Zatsu, you roost again, Lilligant. You go for another Quiver Dance, actually. Let's get your special attack. Let's let's see if we. Okay, yeah, it's Y. So let's see if we can try to get your special defense as high as we can. Maybe we can live. A, maybe we can live an overheat or a, a heat wave or a fire blast. Probably not. I probably just made a really terrible decision. Fire Fang? What? I love against down regardless. No. All right. Okay. 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 So a Fire Fang Charizard Y. Why? <laughs> no pun intended. All right. Okay. I still am in a better spot, though. So... Here's what I'll do. Here come... I'll bring up Tyranitar. He's probably banking on Solar Beam to hit this Tyranitar, to hit Tyranitar with. So, for one thing... Okay, I'm gonna simple beam. No, actually won't matter. Actually won't matter. I thought you really didn't use the deck. I'm gonna stored power the Charizard, and then I'm gonna mega evolve and dragon dance. There we go. Charizard's down. Thank you, Zatu. <laughs> okay, up and Landorus is confused. And Tyranitar is now a little faster. So I could have simple beam Tyranitar, but I actually didn't want to. Well, actually, no, I don't think it would have mattered regardless, because the sandstorm would have come out would have come out immediately anyway, and that's what I was hoping for. I didn't want I didn't want the sun there. Oh. And Rotom Wash is back. All right. So now I'm going to simple beam Tyranitar, and I'm actually going to go ahead and use Rock Slide. Actually, I don't know. Hmm. I probably should, but I don't want to risk missing Rotom. Because if Rotom hits me with a Hydro Pump, I'm fucked. <laughs> so I'm actually going to be- I'm going to play it safe and use Crunch. Actually, you know what? No, back it up. Simple Beam... Wait, no, what am I saying? No, Stored Powered. Let's just aim fucking at the Rotom. Let's get this guy out as fast- I'm not worried about Landorus. Let's just get rid of that Rotom as fast- Okay, yeah, I thought so. Okay, good. And now that Landorus is about to take a huge crunch. There we go. Citrus, all right. Land the, the Thunderous is Prankster. That's a thing it is, isn't it? Or, was it, or, am, I, or am I thinking of Tornadoes? Oh. I'm fairly certain that Thunderous also gets Prankster. Yo, yo, yo. The fuck? 
Okay, yeah, this is definitely a, a prank to Thunderous. It's probably gonna use something like Thunder Wave or something. Something that's gonna screw me. So, stored power. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, I know what he's doing. I know what he's about to do. He's probably about to fake out Tyranitar and then do something to Zatu. So, I think my best bet, actually. Oh, you don't know, taunt though. I'm probably hoping for that. You see, this is why Pokemon's so interesting. There's so many factors you have to think about. So you know what? Let's just get rid of Yo Yo Yo, and then we'll go for a Dragon Dance under the Dragon Dance on Tyranitar. Actually, you know, what? let's go. Let's just go for the. Let's just go for the Ice Punch. Let's see what happens. There goes Yo Yo. Okay, there we go. Wait, huh? That's not a prankster, you're defiant? Really? What the <laughs> fuck? Who uses defiant thunderous? Interesting. But okay. Tyranitar is a little weaker, unfortunately, but that's fine. Yeah, well, not be able, he's down to his last two. And the Togekiss looks like it's still paralyzed. Yep, so this is take out the Togekiss and then Ice Punch Landorus. No. Ah! The freeze! The freeze! It's over! I just won! I actually just won! <laughs> well then. Well then. That's just really- that's just insult to injury. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, wow. That was just insulting. I'm sorry. Alright. Okay, so now let's move on to the next match. Oh, with the exception of the Rotom and all shiny team, interesting. Okay. Up. Uh, it's another beat up team. Because look, we have the Weavile and we have the Justified Clebellion. Okay, so if you want to play it that way, Weavile is no doubt faster than Lightning. That's a fact. Okay. Hmm. How to start this off? Go with Linoon and Melodic. Weavile and Cobalion? Saw that coming. Okay. How fast is it? Yeah. Oh, Weavile is no doubt faster than me. Okay, I'm going to Thunder Wave Cobalion. Then I'll get my coil started with Melodic. Here comes the beat up. And actually, come to think of it, it's much smarter to use Cobalion for a beat up Pokemon as opposed to Terrakion, because Cobalion can take quad resist dark as opposed to just only uh, only double resistance, so it can take the beat ups better. So let's see. Um, Cobalion's okay. fast? Cobalion's faster? Oh, sh wait! Hold on! How fast is that Weavile? If I knew it was only that fast, I would have I would have used Simple Beam on Cobalion. What the fuck? Now I'm all kinds of confused. But you know what? That's fine. Um, Melodic's starting to get up, starting to get its, its its stats up there. All right. So now, Lanoon, I have a Flame Orb on, because it has Quick Feet. So now what I'm going to go ahead and do is... Hmm. Actually, let's Simple Beam Melodic. And then Coil again. Let's try to get Melodic's defenses up as high as possible. So that way I won't take that much damage from Cobalion. Okay. 
Okay, he want, he just wanted to let him dead. That's fine. All right. So, I think in this in particular situation, let's see, that's a Weavile. Um, hmm. I guess... I actually don't know. Because Weavile shits in... Like, we, these, both these Pokemon shit in a lot of these Pokemon here. Melodic really is my best bet. Um... What does he have? I need to preserve Zatu. And there's a lot of water types. I think I'm going to go ahead and scrap Tyranitar. Let Tyranitar kind of be the bulk. Let's get a Sandstorm started. And then I'll start with a Dragon Dance. Hmm. Actually. Yeah, I'll just go with the Dragon Dance, see where that kicks me. And then I'll go for another Coil. I'm Melodic. Power punching. Yeah, he's trying to get his Weevil strong. He's, he's, he's Weevil strong too. That's fine though. Because the Weevil is about to die. The Tyranitar is also probably about to die too. <laughs> oh, interesting. Okay. Alright. Um, let's go for the Rock Slide, and then I'm going to go for Recover and Melodic. I don't think Tyranitar is outspeeding Weavile. Even at plus... No. Well, then again, it... Lanoon earlier outsped Weavile. This isn't a fully... It is? How odd. Well, it's about to die regardless. Okay, we've always gone. And Melodic recovered. Let's go for another close combat. Oh, it's paralyzed! Even better! Sweet! We're getting we're getting places. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. So now let's see. What's he bringing up next? What time wash? Okay. Hmm. Let me go for a crunch. No. Well, I need I need to get damage off, so I'll, I'll get a crunch on Rotom Wash. And frick, Melodic cannot really hurt Rotom Wash at all. It's a, it's, a, it's an electric type. Let's go for Aqua Tail and Cobalion. Let's get rid of let's just get rid of Cobalion. Cause that Wash is gonna be a problem for me. Ooh, nice bit of damage. Yeah. Oh, he went for Tyranitar. Really? It was this Cobalion. Okay, an interesting choice. Not what I, not what I, not what I would have done, but okay. All right. So now let's keep Melodic as alive as long as possible. Let's bring out Clefable to be the follow me guy. It's Apom. That's no doubt. A, that's no doubt a fake out Apom. Um. What has better priority, Fake Out, or I think I think actually Follow Me may only plus two priority. What's what was Fake Out's priority? Plus four? Shit. I'll go for Follow Me anyway. Then I'm gonna go for the um. Shit. I think I'll just go for the Aqua Tail on Rotom because it'll do more damage at least than Iron Iron Tail will. And plus. Almost full at max out attack. Let's see what it does. I don't think it's gonna kill though. Yeah, he faked out. Okay. It's fine. We live in because Melotic has a really, really good special. Yeah, he resisted. Okay. Alright. So now Clefable, you go for the follow me again. I'm gonna Aqua Tail the Rotom again. Because we want I want that Rotom gone. I want it dead. Yeah, Rotom is an interesting uh, Pokemon in the sense that it's really bulky. 
Like, Rotom, the Rotoms in general are pretty bulky. Okay. But Rotom Wash in particular because it's also half water. And it gains access to Hydro Pop, so that's always a plus for it. So, yeah. <laughs> this is good, though. This is good. We got rid of it. And here comes Gyarados or Swampert. Which Melodic can take out, or not Melodic out, Lilligant will be able to take out really easily if I play my cards right. So I'm going to go for the Soft Gold on Clefable, though more than likely the Sambion's about to kill it. And then I'm going to go ahead and go for the Recover on Melodic. Because it has an almost maxed out defense, physical defense, and both Ambipom and Swampert are, real, are physical attackers. So they're more than likely going to want to go for Clefable. Let's see what happens. So no, even if they go for Clefable, that's fine. Clefable is literally there to be a meat shield. Melodic is living this turn. I doubt, unless they crit me, which will suck, there's no way they can take down Melodic. Even if they gang, even if they gang up on it. Yes, there, there was Clefable. Cover. He was a power up punch. Okay, he's trying to beef up his Swampert. Alright. So now I'm gonna bring out Lilligant. So we'll start with the Quiver Dance, and we'll go for the Aqua Tail on Swampert. So I don't want to get any I don't want it getting any more powerful than it already is. Okay. Quiver Dance off. Melodic. It's not gonna. I don't think it's gonna kill. It'll do a decent amount of damage, though. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, there goes the Ligant. Well. Danny, you still there? Mm-hmm. <laughs> we just lost Bill again. Uh, yeah. So I'm just like. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Could say words. All right. I mean, so, it's like I literally have like no idea. Like you know way more about this shit than I do. So I'm like I don't know. Oh, and he just ended the game for himself by doing you? that switch out. So now Zatsu has a really high physical defense too. None of his Pokemon are killing me. Are killing Zatsu or Melodic. He lost. There's no way he's winning this now. All right, so he's probably gonna go for another fake out. What I'm actually gonna go ahead and do it, I'm gonna be kind of a jerk and simple beam his Ampipom. And then, oh, the Gyarados actually is gonna be able to take a lot of hits. Um, actually, no. Is that a Mega Gyarados? That's the question. If that's Mega Gyarados, it'll take a bit for me to be able to kill it. So I think what I will do for now Hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll just take down the Ambipom. This is a start. Yep, okay, that's Mega Gyarados. He faked out Zatsu. And Melodic should take it down. Oh, he's dragon dancing. Okay. Alright. I see your game, buddy. So Zatsu cannot hurt this Gyarados. And I can't simple beam it, because that'll just make his Dragon Dance even more threatening. So Zatu is useless against this Gyarados. So let me just roost with Zatu. And then I'm just going to keep Aqua Tailing. Hope for the best. <laughs> Crunch. Crunch. Okay. Yeah, that's not, doing, that's not doing a whole lot. Yeah, so the best I can do is just keep Aqua Tailing and Roosting. And just stall them out. Because thankfully, thanks to Coil, Aqua Tail and or Iron Tail, wherever whatever I use, are not missing that often. And of course, he keeps downplaying Zatu's defense every time. The jerk. Okay. I think I'm actually gonna go for another Coil, because he just keeps aiming for Zatu. 
And Zatu's probably about to die, so... I need to get us. Yeah, there goes Zatu. I need to make sure that my attack status is as high as it can be right now. Okay. Alright, so I'll, I'll be taking the least amount of defense, the least amount of damage I can take from this guy. I, so, I, so is this just going to be like a war of attrition? It's a war of attrition, but the difference is I have recover. I win. As long as he doesn't crit me, but he also does have Dragon Dance, so eventually he will probably get his attack up to a high enough spot where he can do more damage. However, another Aquatel wins this for me, so I'm fine. I win. He's probably going to go for another Crunch right here, or Earthquake, I don't know. Whatever, whatever it is, as long as he doesn't crit me, I'll be fine. Yeah, I win. And there we go. Thank you, Melodic. God damn, that one really did go down to the friggin' wire. Yeah. But I think that'll do it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, yeah, this, yeah once, uh, this was just a, a simple team, as I called it. Her, her, her. And hope you join us next time when I, when I showcase off the next team that I made when I was purely bored. See you all then.